Ladies and gentlemen, good afternoon and welcome to the official weigh-ins as Miller Lite presents Bellator MMA back in San Jose. Some event details in just a couple of moments for those joining us on the live stream. We welcome you as well to the event center here at San Jose State. We'll have the weigh-ins, all the fighters on the scale just momentarily. A couple of quick details tomorrow night. The doors will open here at the event center at 4.30. First fights inside the Bellator cage. The prelims, as always, seen live on Spike.com just a few minutes after doors open, so do not be late. We will hit the air live on Spike as always with Friday Night Lights Out at 9 o'clock Eastern Time, 8 o'clock Central Time as Miller Lite presents Bellator MMA back in San Jose again in the main event headlighting the card. The real punk is back in his hometown, Josh Thompson. It'll be Thompson versus Villaseca in tomorrow night's main event. The action is sanctioned by the California State Athletic Commission. Commissioner Jean Aurelia Chair and Executive Officer is Mr. Andy Foster. Tomorrow night, tickets are still available. Box office here at the Advanced Center or Ticketmaster.com for those that are joining us on the live stream. My name is Michael Williams, the cage announcer for Bellator MMA. Joining me on stage right now, the lovely ladies from Bellator MMA, Lindsay and Dasha. Joining us momentarily, the president of Bellator MMA, Mr. Scott Coker, and we'll welcome to the stage right now to put the fighters on the scale. One half of the broadcast team along with Sean Grandy on uh, uh, Spike for Bellator MMA. Would you please put your hands together and welcome Mr. Jimmy Smith. Thank you so much. We'll start off with our preliminary fights. Check them out on Spike.com. We start out with a catchweight fight, 175 pounds. Nick Barnes versus James Terry. First is scale fighting out of San Diego, California. Please welcome Nick Barnes. Record of nine and one, three wins by knockout, five by submission. One seventy six point six. One point six to go. And his opponent fighting out of Livermore, California. Please welcome James Terry. A record of sixteen and eight. Ten wins by knockout. Eleven wins by knockout. I have been corrected. One seventy-four point eight for James Terry. I'm a submission guy. Totally different. I win. <laughs> I'll try real hard. Have a great hey, one, brother. Thank you, brother. Hey, They'll be kicking it off for us. Nick Barnes versus James Terry. Give it up for him. All right, guys. Good luck. All right, brother. All right, brother. Thank you, Scott. Good luck. Good luck. Good luck. Good luck. Good luck. Good luck. Moving down the scale to the featherweight division, 145 pounds, J.T. Donaldson versus A.J. McKee. First of scale, fighting out of Livermore, California. Please welcome J.T. Donaldson. Undefeated in his young career at 1-0.
145.8 for J.T. Donaldson. And his opponent fighting out of Long Beach, California. Please welcome A.J. McKee. Also undefeated in his young career, 2-0, one win by knockout, one by submission. Wow. 145.6 for A.J. McKee. Two guys getting started in a crowded division, 145, J.T. Donaldson versus A.J. McKee. Give it up for him. Moving up the scale to the middleweight division, 185 pounds. Idris Wasi versus Brandon Hester. First to scale, fighting out of Sacramento, California. Please welcome Idris Wasi. One eighty five point eight for Idris Wasi. Right here, bro. His opponent fighting out of San Jose, California. Please welcome Brandon Hester. Record of two and O, oh, both of his wins by submission. One eighty six point two. Try it without the shorts. One eighty five point six. One eighty five point six for Brandon Hester. Let's give it up for the middleweights, Idris Wasi versus Brandon Hester, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, good luck tomorrow night. Move down to the Bantamweight division, 135 pounds. B, Niimi versus Gabriel Carrasco. First to scale, fighting out of Bangkok, Thailand. Please welcome B, Niimi. <laughs> One thirty six on the dot for B Niimi. Right up here, brother. Little guys are so excitable. Next up, fighting out of San Jose, California, Gabriel Carrasco. Undefeated at six and oh, one win by knockout, two by submission. One thirty five point four for Gabriel Carrasco. Let's give it up for the Bantam Weights. It's going to be exciting. B. Niimi versus Gabriel Carrasco. We're on to the featherweight division, 145 pounds. Eric Sanchez versus Thomas Dion. First to the scale, fighting out of Sacramento, California. Please welcome Eric Sanchez. Tarpon. Tarpon. 
tarp. One forty five point eight for Eric Sanchez. And his opponent fighting out of San Jose, California. Please welcome Thomas Dion. A record of five, four, and one. Four wins by knockout. One forty five point four for Thomas Dion. Another great fight at one forty five. Eric Sanchez versus Thomas Dion. Now on to the Bantamweight division, 135 pounds. Jeremiah Labiano versus Alvin Kaktik. First to the scale, fighting out of Hayward, California. Please welcome Jeremiah Labiano. <laughs> Record of eight and three as a pro. Three wins by knockout, four by submission. One thirty six on the dot for Jeremiah Labiano. And his opponent fighting out of Gilroy, California. Please welcome Alvin Kaktik. <laughs> Record of sixteen and eleven, seven wins by knockout, seven by submission. San Jose. San Jose? San Jose. You bet. One thirty six on the dot for Alvin at Cactic. Let's give it up for Jeremiah Labiano versus Alvin at Cactic. Give it up for him. Another fight at 135, the Bantamweights, Bronson Mojica versus Jose Perez. First is scale fighting out of Dublin, California. Please welcome Bronson Mojica. One thirty five point four for Bronson Mojica. And his opponent, hopefully, actually fighting out of Gilroy, California, Jose Perez. Undefeated at one and oh, that one win by submission. <laughs> 
136 on the dot for Jose Perez. Bronson Mojica versus Jose Perez. The Bantamweights, give it up for him. This next fight in the featherweight division, 145 pounds, Anthony Taylor versus Aiden Duenas. First to the scale, fighting out of Alameda, California. Please welcome Anthony Taylor. Making his professional debut. One forty five point eight for Anthony Taylor. And his opponent fighting out of Gilroy, California. Please welcome Aiden Duenas. A record of two and one, one win by submission. One forty five point six for Aiden Duenas. Two very big welterweights getting it on. Anthony Taylor versus Aiden Duenas, ladies and gentlemen. And our final preliminary fight of the evening is in the flyweight division, 125 pounds. Dustin Moore versus Anthony Doe, first to the scale, fighting out of Soquel, California. Please welcome Dustin Moore. Making his pro debut, he's 25 years old, stands five foot four. Six. 121.6. 121.6 for Dustin Moore. And his opponent fighting out of Sunnyvale, California. Please welcome Anthony Doe. Yeah. Undefeated at 1 and 0. That one win by knockout. One twenty four point two for Anthony Doe. Our final preliminary fight one twenty five Dustin Moore versus Anthony Doe. Now on to the televised portion of our show. Of course, check us out on Spike TV. We start off in the light heavyweight division, 205 pounds, Brian Rogers versus Virgil Zwicker. First to the scale, fighting out of Kent, Ohio. Please welcome Brian Rogers. A record of 11 and eight, nine wins by knockout, one by submission. Two o 
105.8 for Brian Rogers. Are you, Brian? Brian, coming up from 185, going to light heavyweight, you said, I feel better, stronger, faster than I ever have. What are the fans going to see tomorrow night? Uh, new and improved B-Rod, strength and conditioning feels great, covered, healed, you know, got my spider tech keeping me going each and every day, and uh, time to turn on the lights tomorrow. And his opponent, fighting out of Temecula, California, please welcome Virgil Zwicker. A record of 14, 4, and 1, 10 wins by knockout, two by submission. He stands six foot two. You were looking. You were looking. You were looking. I was looking. Not even good. 207.8, couple more to go for Virgil Zwicker. For you, it's not getting into a fight, it's going to war. Having a guy like Brian Rogers you know is gonna meet you out in the center of the cage, what does that mean for you? An exciting fight, uh, he's a, He's definitely an excited fighter. I'm always in, in for a bang. Love to go meet people in the middle. It's my mentality, so it's going to be an exciting day. Make sure you tune in tomorrow. Do not turn in late. This fight is going to be great. It kicks off the televised portion of our card. Brian Rogers versus Virgil Swicker. Give it up for him. Our next fight in the lightweight division, 155 pounds, Mario Soto versus Adam Piccolati. First to the scale, fighting out of Sacramento, California. Please welcome Mario Soto. A record of six and one, one win by knockout, five wins by submission. One fifty five on the dot for Mario Soto. You can take a drink first, sorry. Take a sip, man. And that was hard to talk when you sucked up. <laughs> Biggest opportunity of your career tomorrow night, of course, on Spike TV, Bellator main card. How excited are you to show your skills? I uh, couldn't, couldn't be any more excited and happy to be here. You know, I'm in the best shape of my life, and I can't wait to put on a show in front of, in front of all the fans on uh, Spike TV for Bellator. And thank you guys. You know, can't wait to fight. And his opponent fighting out of Half Moon Bay, California, Adam Piccolati. Undefeated at 6-0, two wins by knockout, two by submission. One fifty five point eight for Adam Piccolati. You're in the same position he's in, both you guys up and comers, right at that sweet spot in your career where you can make an impression. How do you make that impression tomorrow night? By uh, putting on the show that I'm gonna tomorrow night, man, I can't wait. A huge fight in a crowded division, the lightweights 155, Mario Soto versus Adam Piccolati. Give it up for him. Next up, the rematch at 155. Patricky Pitbull versus Derek Anderson, first to the scale, fighting all the way from Natal, Brazil. Please welcome Patricky Pitbull. 
A record of 14 and six, nine wins by knockout, one by submission. One fifty five point six for Patricky Pitbull. <laughs> Patricky, this is a loss you wanted to avenge for a long time. You're moving up in the ranks, but a tough fighter in front of you. How hungry are you for this win tomorrow night? I hungry too much. Now and tomorrow. <laughs> Never ask a guy cutting weight how hungry he is. Bad idea. And his opponent fighting out of San Diego, California. Please welcome Derek Anderson. Record of 12 and two, five wins by knockout, six by submission. One fifty five point eight for Derek Anderson. <laughs> Derek, you said it. A win over Patricky Pitbull puts you right where you want to be in the division of one fifty five but you're a better fighter than you were the last time you fought Patricky. What does that mean for him tomorrow night? Uh, I know he's ready for a war, but he should be, because uh, I'm going to bring it. Do you move up or do you move down this fight? Well, let us know. Patricky Pitbull versus Derek Anderson. <laughs> Got it? A fight I have been waiting for for a long time in the featherweight division. 145, Georgie Karahanian versus Daniel Weichel. First is scale fighting out of Riverside, California. Please welcome Georgie Karahanian. A record of 24, 4 and 1, 4 wins by knockout, 14 by submission. Let's go, Georgie. Georgie, let us see you. Let us move. Uh, One forty six on the dot for Georgie Karahanian. It's been working out. Damn. You're good, ladies. <laughs> Glutes are looking solid, bro. Uh, my first question. Against Daniel Weichel, you know where this puts you right in the title mix at 145. You were so close last time. What does that add to this fight for you? You know, Daniel's a good fight. He brings in the uh, pressure. I'm a guy that comes forward. This is going to be a good fight for the fans. And, you know, this is the last show, and we're going to put an exciting fight, and I can't wait to finish him. 
And his opponent, all the way from Frankfurt, Germany, please welcome Daniel Weichel. Very experienced at 35 and 9, five knockouts, 21 submissions. One forty four point eight for Daniel Weichel. Daniel, your last fight against Patricio Pitbull, one punch away from the title. It doesn't get any easier for you against Georgie Karahani. And what can the fans expect tomorrow night? You saw that, Jimmy? This was championship weight. I'm still on a mission, and nobody can stop me. Tomorrow night, I will set this place on fire. Do not miss this fight at 145. Georgie Karahanian versus Daniel Weichel, ladies and gentlemen. And our main event of the evening, the lightweights, 155, Pablo Villaseca versus Josh the Punk Thompson, first to the scale, fighting out of Santiago, Chile. Please welcome Pablo Villaseca. A record of 10 and 1, three wins by knockout, four by submission. One fifty five on the dot for Pablo Villaseca. You can take a drink first. Pablo, the biggest name, the biggest opportunity of your career. How excited are you to fight tomorrow night in front of the USA crowd on Spike TV? Pablo, con que piense con esta grande oportunidad, la más grande de tu carrera, de pelear con tu nombre grande aquí con Berator mañana. Eh, para mí es una gran oportunidad, eh, es un honor estar aquí y, y voy a demostrar que merezco estar aquí y, y voy a ganar mañana. Dice, dice, it's a big honor to be here. Uh, tomorrow I will prove to everybody why I'm here and I do my best and I will gonna win the fight. And his opponent fighting out of San Jose, California. Please welcome Josh the Punk Thompson. A record of 21 and 8, five wins by knockout, 10 by submission. One fifty five point four for Josh the Punk Thompson. Josh, you know what it was like early in your career looking up at the big names when you were the young buck, being hungry. Now you're the big name. You ready to bring your A game tomorrow night? Yeah, for sure. I mean, anytime I'm here in San Jose, I just want to put on a good show and make sure everyone gets their, their money's worth.
Our main event, lightweights are gonna get it on. Pablo Villaseca versus Josh Thompson. San Jose, you're a great fight town. We'll see you at the fights tomorrow night. Thank you so much. Jimmy Smith, thank you very much. Mr. Scott Coker, thank you. Lindsay, Daja. Hey, for all that joined us here live, we thank you for joining us. For those on live stream, we thank you for joining us as well here at the official weigh-ins tomorrow night. Remember, doors open at 4.30. First fights just a few minutes after that inside the cage. And for those that are joining us live on Spike, 9 o'clock Eastern time, 8 o'clock Central time. We'll see you tomorrow night as Miller Lite presents Bellator MMA. Hey.